So he's going to set you up with an invite to Delarine. It departs from Milius, so you're going to have to get yourselves there. Yeah. You guys are going to level up to level 10. I'm suddenly very dexterous. How do you discover that you have this connection to your new gods, and how do you get in oh, more man. intimidating? What are you- Whoa, 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 whoa! Stop you're intimidating me! Let's say 10% chance I will give you whatever you want. I will also use my shadow blade. Oh, it burns the skin so well! The uh, teleportation circle takes you to Milius, and this is the home of all of the, the richest of the folk here. Because people want to show off that they live here, there's uh, in the welcome hall of this, um, uh, this, this teleportation circle, there's a bunch of the different portraits and, uh, t and plaques to the people who have donated to the, the teleportation circle's upkeep and blah, 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 uh, so that they can be seen as soon as you walk in. Uh, one of them is a one of them is a troll face. Oh. Um, uh, some of you recognise him uh, underneath. It's Elon Musk. Uh, he's uh, one of the richest trolls in the land. Um, he's recently he keeps... picked a fight with a disabled person on tw on Twitter. Did he? <laughs> yeah, this yeah. is the yeah, Elon Musk most recent thing. Great. He, um, yeah. we, 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 Go Elon. We, when did we talk about Elon Musk previously? We <laughs> have... Yeah, you did. Yeah, and that, we did. And I added I it to my things to add. <clears throat> troll Elon Musk. He, um, he, he, the, the, the play on words again? He's... Uh, Elon Musk. Uh, Elon Musk. Elon. 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 We had talked Musk. about him, about a troll that's super He's the wealthiest rich. troll in the land. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and he keeps all of his wealth in a, a sort of tomb of sorts that he calls the Crypt of Currency. Okay. <laughs> Great. Um, there's also one next to him of uh, a fellow called Zhang Yeminator, who uh, is the creator of Toktik, the tabloid paper. Uh, great. Okay. Great, 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 he lives great, here great, as well. Great. Great. Uh, you step out into Milhus, into the lands. Uh, I want you guys to describe what does what does the what is wealthy, opulent, it's so glare, look, it's so much look glare. Like. It's just like, ah, <laughs> guys, God. this looks so beautiful. <laughs> Wouldn't you want to live here? <laughs> look how beautiful this is. Exactly the kind of style look, I look, love. I'm like Everything's a, I'm gold like a and purple. I'm walking eye roll. I'm just like, Ugh. <laughs> but doesn't it look beautiful? It's purples Ugh. and golds and everything sparkly. The amount of good they could do with this. And I'm just like, guys. What do you think about me just trying to steal everything? I don't stand for it. I don't like it. Okay, that's one. <laughs> I don't think it's the best. I, I mean, it sounds like you could we literally could, just walk could, up to a wall and try and break up a <laughs> chunk of wall. It could ruin everything. Yeah, right. I'm amazed like, we've got this. Look at me. Look at me. <laughs> it could ruin everything. <laughs> what are you rolling for? What is that roll for? <laughs> Deceive by <budget check. laughs> Was it a wisdom save to see if you can avoid <laughs> stealing everything? No, I don't. Uh, but I am, I uh, like, my eyes are just shifty as fuck right now, just looking for anything <laughs> loose that my mage hand can... Your mage hand's invisible. Yeah, exactly. Were we given... But the exactly. things he steals isn't invisible. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Were we given any directions of where we're meant to be going? Go to the pot. Oh, the pot. Okay, brilliant. Um, yeah, because it's only accessible by, uh, via the ocean, or via the, uh, the lake, rather. So you, um, you head to the port of Milius. Describe the port for me. What is, what is o it's very opulent glary. <laughs> what does opulent <laughs> wealth godliness look like? What is, and just throughout what is the, the whole like? city is just an overpowering perfume. Yeah. yeah. Like they just have yeah, like, perfumes just, just spraying just over the streets. <laughs> <laughs> and <laughs> magical sprinting perfume. Oh, oh fuck God, God, it's God, it's God, Jesus. I get a whiff of it. Is that fishlish? <laughs> so no, because they'll charge like a hundred gold per fishlish. I, 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 I have to see here. it. I have to see it. <laughs> well, this is a little bit much. Yeah, I hate this place. Yeah. Hoity toity. Hoity yeah. toity. Yeah. It's like, in case you couldn't tell, we're fucking rich. Yeah, oh, it's so eat. amazing, isn't it? Look at all this amazing gold and purple, and everything's got gold trim on it. That's so cool. That's like my bed used to be. It had gold trim on it. And my blankets were made out of gold. And my face cloth was made out of makes gold. Makes a lot of sense. Is that fishlish? I, oh, I wouldn't oh, bother. That's going to be very expensive. He's going to regret that. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, fish sauce could be cheaper here. I might be. I don't know because it's like, yeah, it's not like way in the. Yeah, they're not having to import it. Mm, but we did. I did get into this recently with some comments about like, why would it be that expensive elsewhere? And I was like, well, I mean, it could be whatever price I want it to be. But you could also imagine that it's expensive in the dead frost because they have to import honey. Yeah. But it's expensive elsewhere because they have to import the fish from the dead for us. Because yeah, <laughs> it's only knucklehead trout that's proper fishlish. Yeah. People make mm. it with tuna and stuff, but it's not the same. Uh, so I'm, just gonna, I'm, sorry, I'm, I'm taking the time now. You're going to go fish <laughs> the right time wanna, for that? Yep. 
All right. Yeah. You go to a you go to a fishlish uh, so vendor who is not go just a, a not just a crappy yeah. stall on the I'm street. Not, it's like a okay. well, every time we go to a new town, we're going to do fishlish casino, and Bob just going to get laid. Every single time. And then we can kind of move on with the. So go ahead, stop. Correct. Yep. There is a fishlish restaurant that you find. That's a that's that's fancy. I imagine it's one of those ones where you go in and there's like glass cases of fishlish on the. Yeah. It's 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 called a booty fishlish. Yeah. It's mm. co- it's called somebody's like name or something. It's like a fancy yeah, Emmanuel's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just called Emmanuel's. Fishlish. And, you're, um, and, fishlish. and you walk in and there's fishlish, and it's like you wonder how much is the rent on this place because it's just huge it's and they're not utilizing it. <laughs> it's just like these individual cabinets of fishlish made with different types of fish and different different uh, qualities. Different lish. One fishlish. Different lish. One fishlish, please. 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 But they've got many fishlishes. Oh, that one. Yum. Oh, a grand taste. Uh, would you like it presented with uh, Do you want to check meals? what the price of that is uh, first? It's fine. I, <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> I oh, this is going to be one of those restaurant situations where you get the bill at the I end. Will, uh, I'll have that presented in its finery. Very well. Uh, all <laughs> you wish Let's just establish uh, real quick that you uh, are. Are we staying outside? Yep. Yep. I'm, I'm not. Because he will try and take. Right I did pilots. that thing where you kind of walk into a store and go. Mm. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I just walked in and went, nope. All of the trimmings. All of the trimming. Very well. Um, <laughs> and he, so and he, and he, he sort of, <laughs> and a team of people come out from the back, all dressed in fineries with things sort of draped over them. <laughs> Some bunch of preps. Wait, he just wipes now, his eyebrows. Is, is it, yeah, wait, yeah. But, wait, I quickly pop my head in. Bodra, um, so we know how people eat fishless in the dead frost. Do you know how they eat fishless here? Uh, I'm assuming uh, according to its culture, <laughs> which from where it originates. <laughs> we all, uh, like, just there's, there's just a window. This Maitre sort of guy waves his hand boom, and boom, magically boom, this boom. case yeah. lifts off of this thing, just sort of levitates up. Um, <laughs> You see, there's a gentleman that I don't know what he's doing. Get my eyebrows out of the way. There's a, there's a gentleman with, um, <laughs> with uh, two magical uh, magical tongs that are only this big, but he like uh, activates them, and this, this golden light emerges from them to extend the tongs. How much gold do you he have? Takes the, he takes okay, the fish lish, um, and then he passes it down to the next person, and the next person has this bucket of... Uh, <sighs> this bucket of uh, I don't know enough about food. <laughs> he's got gold some, dust. Gold dust, and he, and he sort of rolls it in the gold dust. Mm. Uh, the gold dust is the herbs and spices that the fishlish would usually yeah. be rolled in. Um, it, it takes to the next person who has this. Um, uh, he's just he's just magically holding out in front of him this orb of boiling oil, and it just passes through, and you can see it. <laughs> as it passes through the. Yeah. Are you gonna back out before it arrives at you? It's like slowly comes around and then you're just gone. (laughs) 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 The camera follows it down all of the process. Gets right to Butcher is legging out the door. Butcher's just like nope, nope. Yeah. Uh, it gets uh, oh. there's there's a um, drizzled with rubies. <laughs> Goodness, it's <laughs> crushed yeah. ruby on top, and um, mm. and then it passes mm. past in front of um, a a druid of sorts mm. who conjures uh, create uh, conjure, Are these guys conjure woodland in the back. Yeah. To like wow, it's for a the fancy price, restaurant, yeah. bro. for the price that he's yeah, about right, to pay, okay. they can mm. all get, earn a decent <clears throat> wage. Um, this <laughs> druid casts conjure woodland beings and conjures fairies, and mm. the fairies sprinkle pixie dust over oh, it yeah. as it goes. <laughs> mm, taste <laughs> this pixie dust. <laughs> Is that, that? That's great. Is that? I want one. Um, I want one uh, a fishlish, please. Excellent choice, sir. Uh, would you prefer the perfection package, the spectacular package, or the extravagance package? I will spare no frills. Very well. Good. One with all the trimmings. Let's do it. Here it comes, sir, pulled okay. on a golden chariot by a griffin. <laughs> Great. Well, as, it, as you can see, they are going to take it from the chariot with golden tongs and place it into the vat of oh, oh. acid. Oh, there's no, no need to. I'll just take it. It's, well, almost started, sir. After the acid oh. that was uh, procured from a hill giant's stomach to season the meat, it is taken from there and placed into golden droppings from a unicorn. Yeah, right. Oh, uh, I, After I, it has been rolled, sir, of course you don't want to eat it yet, no. so it moves on to the next stage mm. where it is dusted lightly by the tears of a celestial r- rainbow maker god person. You're doing well. Thank um, you. Thank you. <laughs> I want each of you to give me something as well. What else? Okay. Um, uh, the honeycomb. There's like honey, like I guess the like, I don't know, bee, there's a beehive. There's a bee, an entire beehive. <laughs> it's like a beehive. Like, 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 with a beekeeper. Bee, the, bee, like, the, the beehive is brought out yeah. on like a horse and carriage situation, yeah, yeah, but the horse yeah. is like a griffin. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> and it's yeah. in this golden carriage <laughs> with a bee, a beehive uh, they, on the back. They extract <laughs> one drop of honey and then burn the hive. <laughs> <laughs> mm. <laughs> with a dropper. 
<laughs> Wonderful. <Pet him. laughs> and kill the griffin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> behead the griffin. Take a drop of its blood. <laughs> a drop of the griffin's blood. Um, How much does a griffin cost? The, they, uh, yeah. the, there's mm. a miniature black mm. dragon that they have that, I don't know, it's like the potion you talked about earlier yeah, to yeah, make yeah, it yeah. small, and it passes in front of that, and the black dragon goes... And, and no, like, you know what else? And like, it's like, it's like dra- dragon caviar. Like, there's dragon yeah, yeah, caviar. Yeah, yeah, and they sprinkle some of that on as well. <laughs> just yeah. like, you're all watching outside. Just, just you're miniature. Up against the window. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Just miniature dragon. <laughs> so it's, a, it's, it's not an illusion or something. It's a real mm. black dragon that they've miniaturized. Yeah. Yeah. To, yeah. 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 Just how I like it. Yeah. <laughs> Um, oh, you're going, oh, yes, I love the Black Dragon. And then, uh, and then eventually it's presented to you and, the, and, oh, and they sort of work... It's they, presented they, on a naked woman. <laughs> it's presented out on, on this thing. On the, on and a, you can on choose to as well if you want. It's a, it's a dryad uh, that they've brought in from Ewan Forest just for the purposes of presentation. Yeah. You can um, ask the price yet, or? And then as it as it gets presented, <coughs> you go to it, and they say, no, no, not quite. Uh, well, there's, <laughs> a pre- there's a prison, and, and there's bring, like a, a stage yeah, play around it. <laughs> this guy claps on the other side, yeah. and then the, the walls sort of shift up, and there's like a, pe- a, a, a huge orchestral band <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> around that start to, <laughs> start to play um, as you are presented with this. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, yum. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yum. Gonna be good. <laughs> Wonderful, thank you. Oh, yum. Oh, oh, oh. Is everyone's, and it's it's also, does everyone stay? Just watch this. This has been said, but it's also a very small. It's, <laughs> yeah, it's, 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 it's smaller it's than the one we had in the fish and yeah. the dead frost. So are all these people just standing around behind you right now, just yeah. wait, watching. Oh, yeah. Just oh, that, yeah, that was. Big. And and they bring along security to make sure the person doesn't run. <laughs> like the, the, oh, there's magical it, security. Magical security. Oh. Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Oh. <laughs> How are you eating it? So. Um, Mm. <laughs> 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 Immediately all of the eyes go wide, the van just stops. <laughs> As you can see, after it has been lightly drizzled in the blood of an actual god, wow. it is finally ready to eat. Wow, it's quite, it's quite small. I mean, oh, it's good. Small but flavorful, sir. Um, okay, well... Uh, Would you care for me to get you the utensils? Uh, oh, no, no, it's fine, it's fine. It's, I come from, you know, the frozen north, so we, we do things a bit differently over there. Oh, I see. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm wealthy, don't worry. I've got my, you know, don't think that I'm from the oh, high class. Like, <laughs> right. It's just that yes, we do it. You know. <laughs> but, um. Ah! Yeah. Would you care for another? Is it good, Bodra? The Bodrum? rubies crunch in this good? <laughs> Please tell me it's good. <laughs> it is a new experience. Yeah, that was all right. It might be one of those ones that it takes a while to like, adjust it's kind it. Of, but... Uh, like, but, uh, I mean, that's, that's, that's mm, one of those fancy mm, restaurants where it's like, yeah. ooh, that's interesting. <coughs> that's that's interesting. was interesting. Nasturtium. Mm. Yeah. Look, it's quite bitter. Um, compliments to the chef. <laughs> See you guys later. See you guys. Um, <laughs> Please don't work Thank out for that the improv as a price. Oh, I'm looking it up. <coughs> Excuse me. I can't wait to see how much this costs you. Lucky you lo- won a lot of money at the casino. Cause we should back away so we're not within air, so he doesn't see us and mm. try and take more like our money. Oh, he's not gonna f- you can try fucking try and take yeah, it. Why would he, 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 he There's a way that he could like incriminate us with them being like, I know those guys, they'll, they'll help me pay. We should. No. We should. Hey, no, what? Budget. You start to feel really alive, like oh. Oh. like vital, v- vita- vitality is coursing through your system. Like, whew, you're feeling really good. Mm. Uh, you are going to gain the benefits of a Hero's Feast spell, which is a sixth level spell. Um, it gives you several benefits. You are cured of any diseases and poison. You are immune to the poison condition and being frightened. And you make all wisdom saving throws with advantage. Yeah. That, that's what I've currently what, got that cast on you. I've currently got all of that cast on you. Uh, it lasts for um, it lasts for one hour. Wow. Well, we got to do shit now. <laughs> no, sorry, it lasts we got, for... we got one we? hour to find Caliph there. 24 hours. 24 it lasts hours. for 24 hours. Um, you have your hit point maximum also increased by 2d10. Jesus. Temporarily for, 20, for 24 hours. I still want to know the, the bill.
Oh Boom. man, it's gonna be so expensive. Oh. They've just basically cast a sixth level spell on you. That's gonna be expensive. Because what was the fish list? Like a hundred gold or something? Sorry, six. Two gold. Uh, your your hit point maximum goes up by nine. Nine? But still. Uh, for the next 24 Temporary. hours. That was the report, though. We gotta get in a fight yeah, to yeah. take advantage of this. Yeah, we gotta go outside and just play Tem- a fight. <laughs> uh, temporary nine points. Done. And then they and then they present you with a bill. The, the, the bill is presented by a, uh, what's something, let's see. This could be our first combat. The, the, like, same, pixies, oh. the same pixies that did the dust. Yeah. Uh, they, they, flitter, um, they flitter off and then come back and between them they're, they're carrying a, a tray. No, a golden tray. Like 300 pixies come back and form the receipt <laughs> form out the of their receipt. bodies. <laughs> <laughs> they, they're carrying this tray mm. and in it is the, the receipt. It's a single slip of paper that says 100 gold pieces. Oh, that's fine. No, that's not too bad. That's, that's pretty bad. It's like you can afford it, but... It's cheaper so, than I was expecting. So, <laughs> cheaper than I was expecting too. Yeah. Um, so, how much? Was how would you like to pay? Are you oh, paying, so, so, so. In, oh. paying in art? So, would you like to uh, so. trade of art? Are you paying in coinage? Are you play, paying in I just, gold I wasn't ingot? <laughs> gold ingot? It's right there on the wall. Platinum. I, we normally these are. Uh, yeah, it's yeah, written yeah. in chalk up on the wall. Yeah. For the prices. <laughs> yeah. It definitely wasn't um, written in. Did prices. you have to get the dragon caviar? I. Is that is that, is that all? Is it all? That's, that's, is it all that's, costs? That's, that's all? Wonderful. Yeah, For the easy. particular one you chose, easy. there's others. Um, if you are, if you are not satisfied, there are others. No, no, it was wonderful. I just, yeah, I'm, I'm, right, amazed at, I'm amazed at how cheap. Um, uh, it was wonderful. The bar- bargain price here. Here you go. Oh, it's coins. Can, in can a you do some sort of check? Do, like, do they believe him? Like, I mean, if he's giving it, them the gold. Yeah. Coins in a coin pouch. It's been a while since we've. <laughs> done this. Mm. So how do you dealt in such money like How else do you pay? I'm not near you. <laughs> it sounded like you, you could pay with art. How do you normally do you receive the, the, the pouch art? back? Um, no. You, yeah, do wrong. you have anything else? By the way, do you have you? We stole some art from somewhere. Oh, so there's other ways to uh, pay. I, I do have a uh, Chris Beryl gem. Mm. I have no idea its value. You yeah. haven't got it evaluated yet. You could just. No, I'm going to hold on to that. Yeah. Okay, you've got an idea. Can gold? I just get? A, I want to get a feel. I just want to gauge this. Like, like. So can I just rewind? I haven't quite given the gold yet. I'm not just throwing the gaze like, oh, let's pay with the gold or let's pay with the Chris Errol gem. Oh, that's just kind of. Um, we accept. We accept. Yeah, any yeah, you're like, any form yeah, of payment um, that you'd prefer to pay. If you prefer to pay with the gem, I can I'm have like, that evaluated. Be like, be like, just gauge it. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, who are you expecting is like, yeah. to make an, yeah. make an insight yeah. check. <laughs> I'm trying to get like. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, it should have first tried to work like that. Like you just <laughs> held up and. Oh, 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 okay. Uh, yeah. oh. Inside check. Uh, four. Right. Four. Well, you are unable to gauge, um, but they said that they can have it evaluated if you want. Um, oh, uh, could you evaluate? No, that has no, to go away. Oh, all right. Here's 100 gold. We're done. There you go. Yeah. You pay the 100 gold and you're done. You mark uh, off 100 you walk, gold? As uh, you, I am about to. As you mark off the 100 gold, you see that these runes around the doorway. Oh, right. There was, yeah. Delight. <laughs> you had planned ahead. You were oh, never yeah. getting out of there. <laughs> you were getting out of there without paying. I was like, <laughs> whoa. <laughs> Inst- <laughs> Instinctive parents! Hey! But, but, <laughs> but I, I have had, I'm, I, I can't remember the, 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 the details, but Hero's face. Mi- Cook summer? Uh, if you were diseased or poisoned, that's gone. Well, I you are immune so. to poison for the next 24 hours. Disease poison is like having a doll inside you? No. Poison? No. Unfortunately not. No. More of a curse than a, a okay. um, <laughs> good, good try. For the next good 24 try. hours, uh, you are immune to poison and the frightened I'm condition. Permanently or temporarily immune. Yep. yep. Immune to and poison frightened, and the frightened yep. condition. Uh, and you have the temporary hit point, uh, the, um, the okay. increase to your hit points. And you make all wisdom saving throws with advantage. Correct. There it is. So you arrive at the port of Milius, mm-hmm. and you are waiting for your uh, your invite to Delarine to uh, to come to fruition. The, is is someone meeting us here? I yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're standing in the port. We have like, an invite to get there. We have yeah. an invite. You and we've got there. nothing we're not going to add to that because <laughs> I, I have no energy to add to that. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Is it after lunch? And it's it's might be, it might be after lunch. That's it. Our improvs are usually three steps. Can I just say yeah, this is just <laughs> one double shot espresso Starbucks is actually quite delicious and Tom, you said it wasn't. Hashtag non-spawn. This Hashtag, is not sponsored. I don't know if you want to put Starbucks advertising. <laughs> Wait, we oh, can edit this I out. enjoyed that. Thank you. Continue. Oh, refreshing Starbucks double shot. Mm. Let's wait till they pay us <laughs> before giving free advertising. Oh, this is how it works. You, know, you, you advertise the them. Them.
So the four of you enter the scene. Uh, Baradun, you see this beautiful vista ahead of you. And on this horizon, you can swear you can see a little And glint. while I look at the vista, I have a sip of a Starbucks coffee with the logo facing out, with the logo facing out. Goodness, I'm hungry and I could do with some Burger King right now. Oh, Burger King. Yeah. While I'm eating my Burger King, I might use my Apple iPhone. Is this sponsored? No. We I love Apple you know what I love to do? I love to explore Azra and flying Air New Zealand. Air New Zealand. 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 None of these people That's are That's a great call, Greg. I'm loving it. McDonald's. This is no, not sponsored. No, no, Why are we giving free sponsorship? No, no, no. Please do yeah. yeah. no, Air New Zealand. Nike. Adidas. <laughs> but, uh, whoa, there's meteorites coming to, from the sky. Kill you all. Uh, oh, we better get a Tesla shield. Let's get a SpaceX rocket. Air New Zealand. Yeah. I don't know. After a, a while of waiting at the port, you ah. see that this. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Put it down, Alan. I have, Post a, I have a dragon. Chaos. I have Post a dragon. Lunch chaos. I will use right, the dragon. Right, everyone, okay. everyone. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. So you wait at the port for a little while, uh, looking out at the ocean, looking across to the horizon where you can see Delarine. And then you see the water starting to bulge a little bit closer and closer to the, um, the shore that you're standing on. And. Eventually, this leviathan starts to emerge from the water. This humongous whale-sized fish seems to approach. It gets right up to the pier that you're standing on, and then it stops. And you realize in its eyes that it's not quite real. It's not like a real living creature. It's a mechanical beast. And as it opens its mouth, this tongue unfurls like a red carpet down onto the pier. It's a submarine. It's a submarine. <laughs> Um, and as the captain, as the captain, <laughs> good one. <laughs> He's allowed to be excited about yeah, submarines. I don't know. There's just something that really tickled me about that. It's a submarine. <laughs> <laughs> and that was that wasn't Adam saying that. That was Barry Doon's voice. As it happens, Barry goes, "That's a submarine." <laughs> <laughs> it is a submarine. Uh, the captain, Captain Findle, uh, walks down with his three-point hat on and his very large f uh, feather in his hat. Um, to greet you, and he has a, um, he has a, a what is they called it, a manifest of the, uh, the the passengers, and he, in very lots of pomp and elegance, sort of gives a big old bow and says, uh, "I am under, I am to understand that you are uh, coming with me to Delary." Absolutely, mm. I immediately yeah, dislike Absolutely. him because he represents the minus forty nine gold that's been <laughs> taken away from me. I'm like, mm, you're not well, worth no, that it. That was for the whole ride. That was just to get here. Oh, it's free. Ride's free. Uh, then I, then I'm like, hey. <laughs> No, I like. I yeah. sense. I sense he's just annoyed. I'm like, just, just to be clear, that's not the forty-nine gold. <laughs> we've already, no, paid we've already done to that get here. I apologize. I'm here. Hmm. I apologize for my stern look. May I? Yeah. May I have your names so that I can check them off of the list? <clears throat> Who are you? No, Gre Greg. Greg, the garlic farmer. Greg, I have you right here. Please. Um, my name is Bodger. <laughs> Bodger Blodger. Bodger Blodger. I Thank have you, you here. Bob or Bartholomew Osiris Blade Song? Ah, oh, one of the Blade Songs. I have you. Uh, you may have my official title down there. It is uh, Stephen Thorley the third, of course. I do. Good. Have you of course. Yeah, okay. Good. Thorley. Good work. I just wasn't sure if he had. Yeah. <laughs> He's got. Yeah, that's enough. What? What? Nothing. Nothing. Okay. Just. Um, I Sorry, I just wanted to know. I just think. I just think maybe be quiet. <laughs> Welcome to the Leviathan. We hope you enjoy your trip. I'll just have to tick you off of the manifest, sir. Your name? Bodger. Ah, Bodger Blodger? That's one. That's the one, right. Enjoy your trip, sir. Go. Your name, sir? Bob. Bob. Oh, uh, Bob. Bartholomew Osiris Blades. I have you here, sir. Enjoy your trip. All right. Sir? Uh, Greg? Greg, no surname. Excellent. Enjoy yes. your trip, sir. And your name, sir? Um, 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 Stephen Thorley III. Ah, excellent. I have you here, sir. Enjoy. And you, um... Stephen Thorley III? Yes, I have you on here, sir. Stephen Thorley. Oh, so you, you, you weren't expecting, like, 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 uh, like High Sorcerer Baradun wasn't on the list? No, sir. Should, no. Should he be? Are we expecting High Sorcerer? I mean... Uh, hey, St Stephen, maybe shut the f*** up and come this way. Come on. You so don't do, need to tell, do, tell, tell, do tell me. Tell me yes. things. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you? Yeah. Who are you? Hey, what's, what's your favorite? favorite? What's your backstory? <laughs> Uh, and he gives you the backstory um, Which as, you, as, you, as, you, as you get on the ship. If you want me to improvise Captain Findle's backstory, I will. This is the rest of today's session. we get session. on the ship. The rest of today's right. session. Man, he was Perfect. crazy. So what a backstory. Yeah. Wow. 
He was always he always admired the sea. His father was a fisherman. Took him out when he was young. Yeah. Have you tried the fish? I can't believe that his father died in the ocean. Oh my god. Yeah. It's a By the way, I just realized a submarine is because a submarine. <laughs> are, you, are, are, you, are you serious? Yeah. That was one of those things where I always just heard the word submarine. <laughs> You know, just something. Yeah, I, I get it. I get this into I, 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 I was going to judge you for it, and then I was like, I can't. It's I've done things like that. It's like, it's like <laughs> suitcase. I put a suit in a suitcase once, and I was like, man, that's perfect for it. It's a suitcase. <laughs> it's for suits. Welcome, Ben. You know? Or no, an I'm airport. Like a, it's like I, a port. I, I, I'm, for the I'm, air. Fighting, I'm fighting the instinct to rip into you, but I'm like, I get it. Yeah. My I get it. We've all had it. My don't, was to, don't act like you're above me. No, We've all had this. My instinct was to rip into you to, to feel bigger than you, but but you actually, that you saying that was the first time <laughs> yeah. I thought of submarine as well. See? Yeah. See? Yeah, yeah. Submarine. You know? uh, it's like, because you just hear it as one word, <laughs> you and so you take word. it as one word. Yeah, you don't yeah. think about the. Octopus is because they have eight, and octo means eight. Eight limbs. Yeah. Mm. And they've got eight pusses. They've got eight pusses. <laughs> <laughs> I think that, I think that, that is where we need to leave that conversation. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> after uh, after Captain Findle explains the origin of words to you, uh, uh -huh. <laughs> uh, you uh, suffering. Right, right. Wow. He says um, we'll be disembarking as soon as the rest of the manifest has arrived. Uh, we just have a few few more to wait for. Is what? Can you just <laughs> quickly tell me what some other people's name on the manifest are? Uh, we we've got Princess Ladakeep is arriving um, mm, uh, and her entourage, nice. mm, and then we'll nice. be sitting sitting off. Oh, is that the last yeah, person? Yeah, uh, yeah. Princess, Lon Princess Lorna and her entourage, yes. Yeah, entourage. Um, oh, who's in her entourage? And as she, uh, as you oh, turn, man. you see along the. You turn and see as she's arriving up the pier as well in a carriage. Um, Princess Lorna Ladagip, which we haven't seen yet in this campaign, but in the in the um, isolation games, uh, was played by Brit. Mm. Yeah. Um, <coughs> Yeah, it was. <laughs> <laughs> you remember that? No. Just FYI, this is a spoiler warning for the Isolation Games short campaign that we ran. If you haven't seen that, there is stuff coming up in this campaign that will spoil the ending of that campaign. It's a short series. It's on this channel. You can go and find it and watch it. Should be an easy watch. Go do that now and then continue watching. She murdered your character. No. You remember that? Yep. <laughs> 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 it's been seems so long. Like, seems like we need to get Brit back for the green screen. There's twice now that she's going to appear potentially in the green screen. Yeah, sure. Um, yeah, I was I was really trying to get you guys here while she was at the table, just so yeah. I could force her to interact with her own character, like you guys all have. But <laughs> c'est la vie. Um, she marks off the manifest as well and uh, climbs aboard. Um, she is introduced to you and is um, uh, happy to see you. She doesn't know any of us. No. Uh, she doesn't know any of you, um, not in this in this particular campaign. And then the carpet, the the carpet tongue of this Leviathan I just quickly walk, rolls up. Uh, no, I'm not going to do that because Baradun wouldn't know that. Never mind. Rolls up and the mouth closes and it whoo, sets off below below the ocean for the um, the voyage over to Delarine. At some point during the voyage, uh, Lorna Ladagip will come to you guys um, privately and say, um, "I understand that you're adventurers." Heroes of sorts. Yes, we are. You've been are. responsible for the uh, the death of the dragon on Erangal, I understand? Uh, yes, uh, there was also a uh, stone giant in there as well, mm. um, which we... Sorry, uh, when you say privately, is this one-on-one -on -one or just as a group? Privately as a group. Pri privately from her entourage and the rest of the passengers. Remind me, movies. the stone giant killed the dragon, we killed yeah, the stone giant, okay. yeah. but we're going to go with it that we killed them both. The, the, the Let's just be vague. <laughs> we, the pro we took care of the problem. Yeah, took care of the problem. The, the dragon is dead, and there was also a stone giant. It's also dead. Wonderful. Um, Money, please. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My family doesn't really deal in money for such things, but more mm. favors when you get to this sort of favors, level. Favors, please. Well, uh, favors usually go both ways. If you do something for the ladder keeps. Because you're not actually saying that, are you? No, I didn't say that. Comedy you, offer. Yeah, comedy if you, offer. If you, if you, you go with If you give kind of favors. Flat. Uh, for the Ladagip family, we can owe you something in return. Um, mm. What do you know of the Silwins? Ah, oh, yes. I... Oh, uh, just, not just specifically, so what do you know of the, the Silwins? Thing, <laughs> the only thing uh, I... Ah, yes. <laughs> Their name? <laughs> that they're a family? I want to I hear what you. Potter thinks of the yes, Silwins. Yes, well, are they, I'm glad they... Actually, they actually immediately go, do you know anything of the Silwins? I, 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 Silwins. I, I'm glad you asked. The, Sil the Silwins are one of the high families. Good. Uh, 
they in they, they specialize in a special type of specialty <laughs> magic <laughs> you're kind of still right yes. really that's amazing <laughs> Keep going. Let's see, how much, can, let's see yeah. how much you can get right. You're, you're stuck they, looking into all they the right speci- They do specialize in a particular type of magic. They, they specialize in magic and... Uh, I, I personally am a big fan. Oh shit, of, really? The, of, <laughs> I'm a big fan of... Of, of vanquishing... Well, of, of putting, putting them, them in line. The, yeah. Oh, okay. Dear. I'm a big fan of putting them yeah, in line. Good. I'm, I'm glad to hear it. Yes. Uh, uh, absolutely. Uh, yeah, it was, I uh, mean, uh, unnecessarily it dangerous. Seems our, it seems <laughs> our, I'm a big um, fan who felt everyone just <laughs> clench. <laughs> <laughs> the, only, the only thing... Well, I know a few rumors about the Selwyn family, yeah. but the one main thing I know to be true is uh, Inquisitor Bonecaller, of course. As we know, was you know the the worst necromancer in the entirety of Azerim. Mm. Right, was used to be a Selwyn ma- family member. Yeah. Exactly. It angers I, me I, how I much defeated you know. him. Because <laughs> I, de- I defeated him. You're right. Okay. And and me, me and knowledge. a whole me and a whole lot of adventurers defeated him. So, so right. it's um it's the used to be a whole lot of adventurers and I. Sure, would be the right English there. <laughs> I was going to accept either. <laughs> I'll allow it. I'll allow it. It's the used to be. Which is concerning the Ladagib family at the moment. Mm. There are rumours that the Bone Caller is not as defeated as one would think. The Thorleys are a real family. Wow. As we all knew, because you're part of that family. Of course. A <laughs> cannibal, too. A cannibal. Cannibalise many of her victims who were never found. I'll whip off all my clothes. We can make it. Fiesta is like. Huh. Hey, everyone. Hope you really enjoyed that episode. If you did, please just tell a friend about it. Get more people watching. The more, the merrier. And of course, if you want to watch more of our stuff, as per usual.